All right, let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Aswan Crookshank, your one and only Moose Swiftly speaker, checking in for a daily Moose Swiftly thought, giving you a perspective on teamwork that you will not get anywhere else. Ah, always got to love it. Always love it when KD makes headlines. Always love it when my man Kevin Durant makes headlines because it always brings me back to the DMV. You know, he's from my hometown out in Maryland and that, well, I was Silver Spring. I believe he was born in like Prince George's County. It's pretty much the same area that I'm from and that's what it is out there. You know, one of the reasons I excelled and became a football player is because I was absolutely trash in basketball and they do exactly what KD did. So those, for those of you who don't know, Kevin Durant made headlines because he called out he basically called out his teammates and said, we have, I don't even remember the players' names, but we have so-and-so on the roster. How many games do you actually expect us to win? You guys expect us to win because Kevin Durant's on the floor, because number seven's on the floor. But look at my teammates. They're absolutely terrible. And in so many words, that's what he said, right? And I love that he said it because it brings it right home. It brings me right back to exactly why it is I do what I do every day. What gives me the material, what gives me the passion, what gives me the, the joy and the satisfaction of what I am doing now when it comes to teamwork, speaking on teamwork, the entire brand, the Move Swiftly brand is all on teamwork. This is easily, easily the best player in the league right now. The best player in the league right now. I mean, yes, we, we're always... We're always kind of discounting everything LeBron has done because we're always comparing him to Jordan. So because of that, we got to give it to KD. And even KD, even KD, as great as he, as he is, needs teammates. He needs teammates. And one of the things that happens, especially when you grow up in the area that I grew up in and when you play basketball there, they're going to keep it 100 with you. You know, I can remember being a kid, right, actually before I got to high school, before I got to high school, there was kind of a, a slight, <laughs> this is kind of funny because I was I was considering trying out for the basketball team. And I remember I was talking to one of my friends back then and you know, he was one of those like middle school all-stars and you know, everyone expected him to do great things on the basketball court in high school. He never panned out. But one of, one of the things, one of the things he told me before I got to high school and I was kind of talking, I was kind of kicking around the idea of trying out for the basketball team in high school. He looks at me, he goes, don't do it, man. Don't, don't, no, stick to football, bro. <laughs> stick to football. And that's, you know, that's the mentality out there. And I'm, I'm so happy he said what he said. And, and all the people that are talking about how he's not a great leader. Let me tell you something about the media, all right? This is, this is one of the things I want you guys to understand as athletes about the media. They build you up to break you down. That's how they get paid. They build you up to break you down. So Stephen A. Smith, as, as complimentary as Stephen A. Smith has been, to Kevin Durant, calling him the best in the world, doing all that. He gets paid based on breaking him down in his most, the, the one thing that goes viral is when he says that he made the weakest move in NBA history, right? because that's how they get paid. That's what makes for great TV. So understand, uh, I'm telling you this from the perspective of someone that's been there, scouted, coached, and played, done all three, and now I'm a member of the thought leadership world, and I can see these kinds of things happening before they happen, and now my nephew is playing ball and all those kinds of things, and he's starting to show and excel and kind of come into his own, especially as a basketball player player understand the media is here to build you up and then it's gonna break you down all right you gotta have teammates man you gotta have teammates you gotta have teammates that are gonna give you that foundation when it's time for them to break you down because that's the way it works build you up to break you down they build you up to break you down as much as they call him great as soon as he makes an honest statement and that's what that's what's so disgusting about this entire thing you say he's not a great leader yet he's being 100 percent honest about his teammates he's not telling you oh he's not giving you that cookie cutter answer oh yeah my teammates are great we just gonna work hard. no he's telling you look these dudes we ain't winning with these dudes that is leadership that is being honest that is being straight up that is being 100 percent honest so with all this bullshit about how he's not a leader i think that's completely ridiculous and that's just a way of of continuing to break him down because that's what sells ad space that's what gives that's what gets viewership that's how espns and the fox sports and all these media companies that's how they get paid all right i'm just giving y'all some game i could give you i'll give you some more i give you some more every single day but again if you're listening to this on the moose with the podcast that's what i'm trying to say so before i really get going i might end up you know talking for hours on this because i can speak on this for hours and i okay shut up asshole. let me just get to it all right if you're listening to this on the Move Swiftly podcast, make sure you hit the follow button. We're coming out five days a week, coming out five days a week, five strong episodes a week, something that's going to get you up, give you a quick message every single, every single day. 
So be sure you subscribe to that and follow that and all that good, good stuff. Main thing, makeyamove.com. That's M-A-K-E-Y-A-M-O-V-E.com. Now, there is a wealth of information on the one website from books to hiring seminars to workshops to the bundles, the Plus Athlete bun plus, LY Ath plus LY Athlete Bundles, plus L excuse me, plus LY Business Bundles, boxing lessons, sports marketing courses, tons of things that are going on, a lot of moving parts on that one website. Just go on there, inquire, and see where you fit in. We're all about taking the lessons that I've learned as a football player and applying them to your staff, to your team in business so your staff is moving as a cohesive unit where everyone, every single person knows their role and everyone is holding each other accountable to keep getting better and better and better and better and better and better, and better every single day, all right? As one Crookshank, your one and only Move Swiftly speaker, checking out. You guys continue to move swiftly. We will talk more soon.